Give me one pure and holy passion. Give me one magnificent obsession. Jesus, give me one glorious ambition for my life. To know and follow what I do. Hello, my dear friends and family. I trust you are doing well today. Thank you for being here with me. God is so good, isn't he? Amen. I thank him for the hope we have each day, his grace and his inspiration. Today behind me, the image is of a tent. Yes, I'm inside a tent. Can you see that? Yes. And isn't that beautiful out there? God wants us. Well, well not God wants us, but when we're inside a tent, we need to step out, right? So take Put one foot in front of the other. <laughs> what is that from? Some snowman. Frosty the snowman. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> let's get started with God's word. Today's reading from the Holy Bible is Genesis 15, 5, NIV. He took him outside and said, look up to the sky and count the stars, if indeed you can count them. Then he said to him, so shall your offspring be. The word of God for the people of God. Thanks be to God. God promised Abraham at 75 years old that he would become the father of many nations. It seemed impossible, but God urged him to trust in him and seek his guidance. When we focus on God and trust in him, we can accomplish the impossible. Break out of your comfort zone and have a bigger vision. Our Heavenly Father controls the universe and can make a way when you don't see one. Believe that good things are coming your way and watch. Watch as impossible situations turn around. When you say yes to God and fearlessly act on his calling, you become an inspiration to others. Amen, amen, amen. So step out of your tent and let the Holy Spirit do his will in you and become an inspiration to others. Glory be to God. All right, let us pray. Heavenly Father, wow, thank you. Thank you so much, Lord. I am so grateful for your call for us to step out of our comfort zone and, and just seek the bigger picture of what you can do in and through us. Oh, Father, we know that we can live this life, Lord, with you. That you would, we pray, Father, that you would always remind us of your promise. That you are with us always. And you will and can do all things in and through us. Father, we, we want to do everything that you have spoken over us, Lord. So we want to keep our eyes, our ears, all of our five senses focused on you, fixed on you, Lord, so that we don't miss a step, a beat of your you blessing us as we bless others. Father, we are confident, Lord, that we will achieve all things that you call for us to achieve in your strength, in your time. And we ask of all these things through your precious, powerful, amazing, awesome son's name, Jesus. Amen and amen. All right, my dear brothers and sisters, until tomorrow. Boca!